40 years I got in this place. 40 years of my blood and sweat. <laughs> no every inch of this place, every dusty corner, every rib of oak on those barrels, every year of every bottle in here. Uh-huh. I can see it'll be sad letting go of it. Sad? Hell no, I can't wait to get rid of it. <laughs> I've been trying to get rid of it for four years now. Till you walked in the door. Yeah. You, uh, bring the check? Sure did. Here you go. Uh, what's that whistling sound? Oh, that uh, happens on windy days like today. Wind seems to come right through the ceiling. Uh, anything else coming through that ceiling up there? I water, for oh, instance? No, no, you don't need to worry about that. Rainy season's a couple of months away. You got plenty of time to patch her up. <laughs> That's a real pleasure doing business with you, Mr. Cranston. Uh, good luck with her. Uh, I gotta go now. Oh, uh, just, uh, Shut that door when you want to lock up to leave. Thank you. Just patch her up. It's so chilly up there. Well, the storm's not coming. Well, welcome. I can't believe you bought this place. It's falling apart. Yeah, another one of my bad decisions. <laughs> Actually, that's why I'm here. Well, let me guess. Now, you want to buy this winery from me? I'm sorry, but there is no sale. Actually, it was about um, your decision, or, or rather my decision, to sell that stock. Uh, actually, I'm, I think I'm a big enough person to admit that I was wrong, and I would like for you very much to come work for me. A full-time part, of course. Uh, I would like for you to uh, sign the contract. In fact, I brought the contract with me. Aren't you going to say anything? I just want to make sure you're through. <laughs> I'm through. Well, in that case, I accept. And thank you. That's a very kind, generous offer. Oh, you're welcome. I, uh, I knew that you knew I was going to come back to you. You know, I didn't know that about you, Eden. I knew that you wanted to run this company in the best way possible. Because you see, there are a lot of people out there that weren't able to admit that they're wrong, and you were. And I knew that you knew that I was the right man for this job. I didn't know that until the stock went up. Uh, I didn't even know the stock was going up myself. I think you took a big chance. Yeah? How about buying an old rundown winery or hiring a young, cocky businessman you don't know anything about? I know enough. For instance? I know you're the kind of man who gets what he wants. Is that a quality you admire? Very much. Well, in that case, um, would a handshake suffice until we sign that contract? You bet. All right. <laughs> hey, I've got to show you around this place. Oh. Have a look at this. Watch your head. Yeah.